All right, everyone, welcome back. I already know who I'm going to be for this episode, and that's going to be Kurt Angle for the European title, because I did remember that the European title needed a bit of love. I haven't gone for it in a while. And I just remember Kurt Angle winning it, and then he won the Intercontinental title to make it, I think it was like the Eurocontinental title, or championship, or champion, I should say. If Dilo Brown was in, I would play as him as a European champion. I'd like to win the title. Or Mark Henry. Mark Henry's not even in it. I don't want a former tag team, Vince. Can I have a hug? See, if I went for the WWF title, I'd have the milk truck. That's his special cutscene, and I think that's it. Oh, test. Capture the world title again. Oh, I keep saying world title. Because to me, the major title is the world title. But, World Wrestling Federation Championship. Oh, he beat him for the title as well. That's good uh, matching up right there. Yo, that was a painful episode. I feel so bad for Farouk. No matter what I did, he always, you know, missed out. Kurt Angle is awesome. I remember he was like the Olympic hero, he has to save the WWF. Oh, that's why he's cheering him on. And then he turned, which I think was stupid. She just kept him as, you know, mind you, then it was like a Double cross, you know, because of him. WWF won the Survivor Series thing. But still. Man, he was hell over at that time. Man, he was always over. He's just an awesome wrestler. And he was hilarious. No matter what he did, it was funny. I mean, don't get me wrong, there were some moments. He always seemed to be like the pervert, if you know what I mean. Like, really sort of getting in a woman's business. But apart from that, yeah, he was always funny. I think one of my favorite moments, and got the VHS, I think, I'm positive it was Unforgiven. It was Kurt Angle and Benoit, they were feuding at the time, and yeah, I've probably told this story hundreds of times, but it's one of my favorite moments. So, Kurt and Benoit, it's like, they're the masters of the suplex, you know, Kurt Angle does a German suplex, but Mai does a German suplex. Uh, I was just messing with him. And they were both in each other's faces, and then... Uh, Kurt got the... They were the first in Rikishi and Scott to Hottie, and Kurt got the stink face. And Benoit was laughing at him, so then they both fight each other. So then I think the next week on SmackDown... Kurt holds Benoit in the corner, and he gets a stink face from Rikishi, and then Kurt's just like... <laughs> But it's like, dude, you got the stink phase as well. Why are you laughing at Benoit? But it was like one of my favourite moments. It's like, ha ha, you got the stink phase too. And they did a, they had a really good match. It was, it's like one of my favourites.
So they always feuded. They had a few. I remember 2001, uh, Chris stole his medals and he was trying to get them back. And he always kept them in his crotch and then... Oh, beautiful. Oh, it's the... I was thinking, oh, I'm going to get the Intercontinental title, but I'll wait. Yes. And so he finally has to get his hands down his crotch to pull the medals out and then he kisses them. He's like, ooh, got ball sweat on him. Oh, I didn't mean to, I pressed it by mistake. Stevie. I always loved the Edge feud <laughs> and then shaved his head. He always so loved when he was a face because he was the Olympic hero. It was such an awesome time during that year with Kerr, but it was always a good heel as well, you know, in your face. You know, I'm an Olympic gold medalist. I'm telling you, you need to drink your milk and go to bed early. You can't be going out and kissing and doing the nasty. That's how you get diseases. You're gonna get your ass kicked. Try to remember some other times I really enjoyed Kurt. It was always, I always liked, I mean, alright, when I was a kid, I would boo him because he's a heel, blah, blah, blah. But I always liked seeing him on the camera, like on the TV, I mean, he, he was always funny. Oh, Sexy Kurt! How could I forget Sexy Kurt? They think I'm cute. I got gold medals. I got the moves that make him all tap out the angle slam. The ankle lock. Marty Jannetty still can't walk. I'm just a sexy girl. Oh, nailed it. I'll make your ankle hurt. I want to do the suit. Ah, trying to do his German suplex. What else was there that was really awesome? I uh, went to ECW, but I remember he won the World Heavyweight title. That was really awesome. I never really watched TNA with him, unfortunately. I mean, I did try and watch TNA, but then Foxtel, you know, they got rid of the license, so then they stopped airing it. But, yes, yeah, so I can't really comment on that. I know he's had some really good feuds. I've watched a lot of, like, videos, doing reviews on some TNA stuff, and he did some really good stuff. Oh, he's Moonsault! I forgot he had the Moonsault. And so, what else could I really say? I didn't really like his return. And then the whole Jason Jordan thing's his son. Just felt a bit out of place. I would have loved if he'd been the heel manager again. Oh, let me do it! Go! I don't think he has the. I think it might be just a Benoit move where he does the multiple. Ah, oh, well, there's one. Oh, what a shot! Look at that bro. That's dangerous. This is fast-paced competition. Who'll be the better fighter tonight? That was excellent. He's going for the back. No. The contest continues. Oh shit. That hurt. My name is Kurt Angle. Took the back. I don't think he has it. He's the best superstar in America. He's the Olympic hero. This rivalry will definitely continue after this match. I just want to test something. Kurt Angle is incredible. Okay, so there's different. It's like the front end of the stun. A counter attack landed. I'm sure he's 
sure Kurt Angle will do well tonight. I just want to figure it out. I don't think anyone could stand that move. I'm sure he's got the multiple. Oh, I did the same bloody move. What is he gonna do from behind? He's got that move twice. What a match! That's not gonna work. Took the back. Who'll be the better fighter tonight? No! Oh. Don't worry. I think we get another match. Yeah, of course the one time taps out. You suck. You suck. Attention. No, we'll do another round. See, that's good if I panic and I screw up during the set, uh, the episode and it's like, I'm 40 minutes in, it's, it's a good title just to say, yeah, this person, yeah, they can have it. Which I feel bad, there's a couple of wrestlers on there that I didn't get titles for. No chance. I wish they'd done his storyline where, mind you, it was 2001. He won his title, like the titles in '99 or 2000. Raven. It's Raven, man, and Kurt. Armageddon. World Wrestling Federation European title. Yeah, let's try and do the German suplex. Gorgeous. Oh, why well, just skip the entrance? I love Raven. It is the electric in this arena tonight. Who's fighting who? We can't miss WWF tonight. Who do you think you're talking to? Here we go. And what just sucks he couldn't really get a break. I mean, Raven was really good. Wait, he was always good on the mic, and he always knew how to do a, you know, a, like his gimmick. But he never really got the chance in WWF. I mean, bloody hell, if they'd done it right, I reckon him and Undertaker could have a really awesome feud. But nah, they just fed him to him and he got squashed. That's not gonna work. Trip. That must hurt. What a match. Right, he doesn't have it. I've gone through every single one. I love that moon salt. Who'll be the better fighter tonight? I remember Kurt did it off the steel cage and ooh, boy did he bounce. The arena is electrified. Oh. I haven't seen that net breaker in a while. 
Why has he done that? Get in. He's furious. Look at the situation now. I got all day, buddy. God, aerial moves just suck in this game. They get up too quick. It's payback time. Russian leg sweep. Nobody can stop this. What the? That's not gonna work. Watch out for his DDT. Hurry, hurry. Oh yeah, he's got the ankle lock. I always like to shut your mouth. It's like they. The opponent drags himself to the rope and he pulls him back. <gasps> Perfect setup! Boom! Beautiful. Kurt Angle. Uh, see, it's only 18 minutes. I might do it again. I wonder if it changes every time. Oh, it's like that's the same. I might as well. I want to do the ankle lock. <laughs> Make someone tap. Nah. It's the same. That's alright. No Kurt Angle's fun players. Test. 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 This is a test. Do -do -do -do. What's the pay-per-view? I'm trying to work it out. Is it No Mercy? No chance, so that's what you got. No, too strong. Pick down the no Mercy! See, just like that, that No Mercy, it looks such an awesome pattern, like it's been sort of spray-painted on, but now it all looks just like clean. It is the electric in this arena tonight. I really like that logo. We can't miss WWF tonight. Who do you think you're talking to? Michael Cole at ringside. Hey, no mercy. I'll have no mercy on your shoulder. You shut up. I like singing. Leave me alone. No mercy. There's no mercy. Good song. There's always a few pay per views with yeah, their own gimmick songs. No mercy. Now I look dumb because I can't think of another one. Armageddon always had the enders here. Well, not always, but a few times. The end is here. The end is here.
I'm trying to think other payment. I mean, money in the bank's got the money, 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 money. Hey, hey. Money, 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 money. Huh? Huh? What other pay per views had sort of the same gimmick song? I mean, I know most of them sort of had, you know, music from bands. I don't like him. Well, I don't like you. This is good. That's a good combo for the ankle lock. You get out of here, I'll come over there and angle slam your ass right into that table. Double axe handle. Third angle always shows a high quality match. I've never seen a fight like this before. Did you see the angle on that throw? That was a nice one. Stand that move. The counter attack landed. This singles match is great. I'm sure Kurt Angle will do well tonight. Bang! Beautiful. Bull. Watch out! I was gonna say, don't you submit? Oh bullshit. <laughs> I'm lucky to see such an excellent match. Test is really a great person. Whoa! Look at the situation now. Close lines. Can I do it? Nice, I just wanted to do it once. Oh, I'll take that. I want to do that move and then do the ankle lock. Move. The arena is electrified. He's yeah. Superstar oh, he's America. near the rope. If he'll shut your mouth, he'd actually pull them away from the rope, which is like a really badass like finisher or submission. Yeah. Nice. I think the reason I liked it so much was Ken Shamrock's finisher was the ankle lock. I would have loved Ken Shamrock and Kurt Angle having a feud. I'm not sure if they did it, just... I think Ken left WWF shortly after his sort of SmackDown debuted. I think a couple of months after. Alrighty, we are done.